Hey guys, what's up? It's Jim Dude, Jim Dude's Guitars, and uh, got a cool video. Um, everybody's heard um, the song Goat by Polyphia. It's a pretty uh, popular song in the guitar community. Uh, Tim Henson is a genius at what he can do on standard tuning and things, and uh, this is a song that I see a lot of people struggle with or want to learn, but um, it's a little bit difficult. I admit I had to use um, a YouTube video that uh, Tim made himself to learn this riff um so anyway just wanted to give kind of like a little basic rundown and lesson on it and um maybe help you guys out so we're starting in a uh, standard tuning here and um you can use your neck or bridge pickup i prefer the neck it kind of uh, gives it more of a bell sound and rings out a little better so basically um to start out you're going to do um some hybrid picking with your pick and your finger and there is a lot of that as well as harmonics in this song so just get ready for that and um you're going to start out on the seventh fret of the low e with your ring finger and then um with the ring finger of your right hand you want to hit the open b string and that's your first so you do that and then you're going to come to the second fret of your high E string and slide up and when you get to or about the 12th fret you're going to hit the harmonic on the 12th fret of your B so all together you've got so far okay so after that you're going to go to your low E and you're going to bend at the 9th fret with the harmonic on the 12th G so and that's what you got so far and take it slow if you have to at first it's uh some techniques I wasn't really used to when I first tried it so then you're going to do a slide with your finger on the fourth fret of the A and the fifth fret of the B. And you're going to slide to the seventh fret on the B and the fifth fret of the A string. Now, here comes the tricky part. Um, this part will uh, definitely take some getting used to. I still don't have it completely mastered. You're going to do another slide, and it's your uh, finger on the 7th fret of the D and the 10th fret of the B. So you're going to slide up to the 9th on the D string and the 12th on the B. So... After you slide, you're going to tap. I guess that's the 20th fret. Hammer on from nowhere to the 10th fret of the low E. Slide again up to the 12th on the D and the 15th on the B. Tap on the 19th and let off and then harmonics the high three strings GBE on the seventh. So we'll go over that again. It's then you're gonna slide, tap, hammer, slide, tap, release and harmonic. third fret low E hit up um, octave chord at the ninth fret of the A and the eleventh fret of the G sometimes I even think he does the and then you're going to do harmonics I use an upstroke for that and then down for the twelfth fret so it's third fret, then this, and then you got upstroke, 
on the 7th of the B and G with a downstroke uh, harmonic on the 12th. I know it's confusing. Um, then you're going to grab that low E bend with the G. And then you're going to do a different slide here, which is 3rd fret of the A and the 5th fret of the B, which is like that, and you slide up to the 5th and 7th, and then you're going to do opening. on so I kind of got a little mixed up there for a second we're back now so then you're going to go to another little hybrid Six, open B, eight on the D, and then open D with the seven on the low E. Back down to the second fret of the E. Instead of doing the harmonic, you slide up and then do this chord. And you're doing the same slide you did before. And then this is the really fun part of the lick. You know. Alright, let's break that down. Just like before. 7, 6 on the G, open B, and the 8 on the D, then you're going to slide on the A from the 7 to the 10, Positions shift up here to bar the 12th on the G, B, and E. Go up to the 14th, 15 like that. Then change your chord down pick, upstroke with that, and you'll have 14, 14, 15. slower than it is faster I believe it or not once you get it down First time around on the intro they stop right there and then repeat the whole thing over on the second time they do it it is uh then you back to the other ending so we'll go through the whole thing slow because i did a really poor job explaining it 
Um, but basically just watch slowly, look at the frets. It's very easy once you get the hang of it and where the harmonics are. It just takes a little uh, getting used to because his playing is very unorthodox to most people. Um, he's very um, proficient with harmonics and things like that that most people have trouble and especially the hybrid picking is something. If you're proficient in it, it shouldn't be too hard, but if uh, it's something you struggle with like I do, it's definitely a struggle. So here we go, we'll start it over real slow. cool look by Tim um one of my favorite things to play by Polyphia still don't have it completely down but wanted to kind of give a little instruction for anyone who might want to learn it themselves uh, I hope you guys like this little uh lesson if you'd like to see me do anything um other lessons on on licks or anything uh drop them down in the comments I'll learn them and do my best to explain them uh or if uh you think uh there's something I might have missed in here that I need to uh improve on you know leave it in the comments I I welcome all criticism and things like that so i really appreciate you guys watching and uh hopefully this video was helpful for you that's what i try to do in all these videos is just try to be helpful and give some information so i appreciate it and we'll see you in the next one